What's good? It's your boy James Me Nasty. And I got that my team pack opening. But it's only 35 35k. Nothing crazy. So let me tell y'all before we get into it. Ooh, look at that, Monte. Yeah, let's you know he yo him and Russell. What? They're gonna be putting in that work, bro. I can't wait to use them. I ain't use them yet. All right, let me tell y'all. So at work, we sold a lot of stuff. So they gave us $50, right? $50, you know, extra. You know what I'm saying? So I bought this VC. I want to let y'all know. Y'all be seeing other people open this pack opening. And they just be like, yeah, we're going to do a 200K. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes they be looking like they didn't even. They look like they built it up from the ground up. Like they saved all. Like they stacked all of this. But I know y'all peeped it. I know y'all peeped the Joe Cool I got earlier, uh-huh. I got the Benno Udra, a good backup point guard. So I'm happy about that. His shot is butter, baby. So <clears throat> I bought this VC. And I said, if they, I was not buying 200000 You know how much that costs? $50. I'm not paying $50. I'm not doing it. I've bought VC in the past for my team. I've always bought VC for my team. Like, when they first had it, like, I'm just like, let me get this $5 and I'm going to just buy this player. Like, I think I bought, like, two players in 2K13. I bought, like, a LeBron and an Oil Durant or something like that. Then in 2K14, they changed it up where you can't buy specific players. You buy packs and then you can... You buy the team packs and you get them or you buy gold packs or whatever like that. Get a guaranteed gold. And then now they change it where it's like a surprise. You don't know who you're going to get. So I think now the way they have it now is is way is, is way better than just buying the packs and getting the favorite player or even just buying a single person. So here I'm just looking like who I got and I'm looking who I'm going to put in the lineup. I would have put Joe Johnson in, but I feel like. He would be better off the bench. His three-point rating. Woo! Look at that three-point rating. His shot goes. I'm gonna need him off the bench. I'm, I need more. I need. I'm gonna need some offense. So Austin Rivers and him, and then Evan Turner. That's gonna be nice. So I just put Monte in there because I struggle with the rookie KD. So Monte will help me out along with Russell. That's gonna be a fast. That's a fast backcourt right there. Too quick. They're gonna be. They're gonna be tearing it up. So. I'm restricted to only three goals, so I have three goals, so, and then I spent the majority of it, and I know it's not like a big thing, 35, you can't really have a lot, but I figured I'd just do a, do a pack opening, show you what I got, how it go, and, um, I'm gonna save up, like, my own VC, like, I still wanna upgrade my mod player, so, with that extra money that the job gave me, I'll probably do another one for, like, more but I don't want to do it anytime soon. Like, I want to, like, do it from the ground up. I want to save it and then spend, get, like, my team points. So, that's how I want to do it. So, I probably won't do one for a while. So, I just want to play with the players I have now. Because I'm already doing good with the ones I had before. And now I just added some good ones. I don't want to, you know, buy 200000 and be overpowered. Because then it's not fun like that. It's fun because you build a team and you have to figure out who goes with where and how to use certain players, you know what I'm saying? I don't want to have a whole goal lineup. It'd be whack. So, hopefully, you enjoyed this little pack open. I know it was really short. Past videos has been really long. I'm trying to cut it short, nice and sweet. I have a new video about the Rex Center soon. I'm out.